Top 6 Best Editing Laptops in 2024 Hello guys today in this video we are going to help you to find out the best editing laptops in market I made this list based on my personal opinion and I try to list them based on their quality durability customer review and more if you want to see their price and find out more information about them you can check our links in the description below and like comment share this video subscribe our channel thank you. Number 6. Apple MacBook Pro 14 inch M3 Max. The Apple MacBook Pro M3 Max is our best video editing laptop overall thanks to a fast performance and a vivid screen wrapped in a highly portable aluminum chassis. Popular across the creative community, MacBook Pros have long been our top choice for best video editing laptops, and the latest M3-powered models are, frankly, in a class of their own. If you want absolute performance here, opt for the M3 Max CPU, it works hard and plays hard. That's because, in a sense, we found the 14-inches MacBook Pro M3 Max to effectively be a Mac gaming rig. It's fast, powerful, never skips a beat, performance was flawless during our time with the machine. Capable of playing AAA games without issue, it's more than capable of running high-end video editing software. During our tests, we ran 4K 30 frames per second video and 4K 24 frames per second ProRes HDR content in Final Cut Pro, and found it extremely easy to edit the footage better still, the laptop still has, for now at least, a 3.5mm audio jack, making it ideal for video content creators. The classic Apple aesthetic remains, solidly built and beautiful from every angle. We've picked the 14 inches model here for its overall portability and power for the price. A 16 inches version is available if you need a larger screen for your video projects, sadly, Apple has discontinued the 13 inches in the M3 lineup. The only real downside, beyond the fans getting noisy under heavier workloads, is the high price. Like most Apple products, the MacBook Pro 14 inches M3 Max is an investment for video editors. Number 5. HP NVX 360. If you're looking for the best laptop for video editing on a budget, the HP NVX 360 is a good choice. When you edit video while on the go a convertible laptop or two-in-one laptop can be handy to boost your creative process. You can use it as a tablet for previewing your source material or exploring transitions with the touchscreen, then the next minute load up your complex non-linear video editor and use it with the keyboard. After testing out the HP Envy, we can confidently state that its 15.6-inch, Full HD 1080p WLED display looks gorgeous and is more than adequate for video editing on the go. If need be, you can connect it to an external monitor or large screen TV via its HDMI or DisplayPort via USB-C. While this isn't a 4K 17-inch screen laptop replacement, what you lose by not having an extra-large display and 4K resolution you make up for when it comes to battery life. Packed inside is an 8-core AMD Ryzen 7 5700U with Vega graphics, a speedy CPU that makes up for the lack of a discrete GPU. In our tests, the Ryzen 7 5500U racked up impressive benchmark scores. It held its own against the more expensive two-in-ones running an Intel Core i7-1165 G7. The NVX 15 also made short work of our Blender benchmarks, rendering in less than half the time of the ThinkBook 14's Yoga. Based on that, the NVX 15 is a good option for creatives working to a budget. For an alternative budget laptop, we'd recommend looking for an M1 MacBook Pro or MacBook Air. You can pick up models with the older chipset at cheaper prices now and they're still creative powerhouses for video editing. Number 4. Dell XPS 17 9730. Big and bold, with a vibrant display, discrete GPU, and outstanding performance, the XPS 17 is a top contender for best video editing laptop overall, especially if you prefer using Windows. But what really sets this apart is that glorious 4K UHD Plus display for impressive detail. With a 16-10 aspect ratio, the IPS panel boasts some impressive specs for editors looking for a laptop with color accuracy. There's the 0.24 Delta, and color spaces are well represented with 188.8% sRGB and 133.7% DCI-P3. It's a sleek machine, chassis beautifully designed and machined aluminum and keyboard surrounded by a carbon fiber that will be very comfortable during those long editing projects. It's not perfect. The XPS 17 is large, heavy, 5.37 pounds slash 2.44 kilograms, and the battery life isn't the best, we clocked it at just over 9 hours. 
So, it's not one you want to lug around too often, and for the premium price, we expect more than the mediocre 720p webcam. It is brighter than a lot of laptops for video editing, but at around 500 nits, it's not by much. With the right content, the MacBook Pro can hit 1600 nits. But when even the base configuration, FHD non-touch screen, Intel i7, 16GB RAM, will give you enough power for basic projects, it's difficult not to be impressed with the laptop's performance for video editing. Number 3. Apple MacBook Air M2. Plenty of the best laptops for video editing are extremely portable, but at 2.7 pounds slash 1.24 kilograms, the MacBook Air offers a potent mix of portability and performance that others, like the HP Spectre X360, can't quite match. But then, this is a laptop that's been designed for on-the-go video editors, photographers, and designers. It's sleek, slim, beautiful to look at, and small enough to slide into your bag and carry with you just about everywhere. There will be trade-offs for such a compact laptop. Chiefly, the screen size, which is just 13.6 inches with a resolution of 2560 by 1664. If you need a broad canvas to edit video, this laptop isn't for you. If that's not a concern, the performance of the MacBook Air M2 is a delight. In our own tests, we edited 4K movies with ease, and the laptop remained almost entirely silent throughout operation. However, we will say that for professional-grade video editing work, we'd recommend opting for one of the upgraded models over the base configuration, which will bump up the price. If you're on a budget but don't want to skimp on performance, the older MacBook Air M1 is still a great video editing laptop for the price. Number 2. HP NV16. Looking for a mid-range Windows laptop for video editing? Designed for video editing, photo editing, even game development, the HP NV16 is suitably powerful for the price. The laptop's performance for creative tasks proved excellent in our tests. We ran Premiere Pro and Photoshop, and had no issues with either, even with high-resolution media and multiple layers. So long as you're not planning on doing heavy AAA gaming on the side, you'll have no problems running creative software on the machine. The display can make or break a video editing laptop, and there's no complaints here. The NV16 features a 1610 4K panel that boasts 100% sRGB, 100% Adobe RGB, and a low Delta E for color accuracy. No DCI-P3, which is typically used in video editing, but it shouldn't affect most general workflows. We did find that the battery life wasn't great in our benchmark test, it lasted almost 6.5 hours, and it'll be less if you're editing a lot of complex videos. And it's not the coolest or quietest video editing laptop we've tried. But for an all-rounder with that's not quite budget and not quite premium, we found the HP NV16 ideal. Number 1. Razer Blade 14. A lot of gaming laptops are good for video editing, since they're focused on high performance and graphic fidelity. And the Razer Blade 14 is our pick of the bunch of you want to a machine for work and play. It's a thin, lightweight, speedy laptop that packs a lot more power than you might expect. In our tests, it easily, and surprisingly, came close to matching the performances of the more powerful Legion 7i Pro and ROG Zephyrus M16. When it comes to creative tasks, the Blade 14 scored well across our 25GB file copy, handbrake, and crossmark tests. So, you'll have no issues running Premiere Pro here. That's not the only reason we like this laptop for video editing. The 1610 screen, though a compact 14 inches, is a sharp QHD+, with a detailed resolution 2560 by 1600 Better still, it boasts 100% DCI-P3 color space coverage, which is essential for many video projects. Elsewhere, we were impressed with the audio quality of the dual speakers, and yes, there's a 3.5mm audio jack for wired headphones. Battery life isn't particularly good, and although it's slated to last 10 hours, we could only squeeze about 8 hours out of it. And that's for basic use like emails, web browsing, office apps. Expect around 4 hours if you're editing footage, playing games, or streaming movies. There's otherwise plenty to love about this laptop. This is the top 6 best editing laptops in 2024. Please make sure to subscribe our channel for this kind of information. Thanks for watching.